we are. Welcome to the outdoors, Missouri. Let's go. Howdy there, folks. This is Billy with the Outdoors Missouri, and uh, I got a little toy in today, and uh, I wanted to kind of show you a little bit about it. This is the new uh, Gear VR from Samsung. Came with my phone. Uh, I got the Note 7 recently. We did an unboxing for that, and you know, it's amazing how simple, yet how complex this thing is, because it's really simple. Like, it's got this focus thing here and there's not a whole lot of buttons going on with it um, I've played with it a little bit and the phone just snaps right in there and I'd show you how that works except I'm filming on the new Note 7 for the first time so uh, I got a little bit of video to show you so uh, I did a video I took a video of the roller coaster um, one, you know one of the roller coaster ones and, and uh, a fishing game I uh, wanted to kind of share with you a little bit, so uh, check it out. All right, so I'm trying to look around and see how this thing works. And it said start right there, but I thought, oh, let's do something different. But apparently, you have to go to that website in order to download um, different scenarios. So this is the one that it comes with for free. Okay, so I'm looking around. It's just a scary mine shaft here. It's pretty cool looking, pretty intense. Kind of look around for you guys, kind of show you what I'm, you know, really gives you that feeling of um, you're really on this thing. It really feels real. These bats made me flinch. They're coming like right into my eye. This got me. Oh man, that is a sick fall. It doesn't give you the same representation uh, in 2D as it does in, in the VR. It gives you just a sensation. Not so much of movement, but the falling really, really does it. And the climbing. And the more you move your head around, the more it kind of spins you. And kind of gives your stomach that feeling of um, changing altitude. So this, um, this gave me some problems with Bluetooth. Um, I can't actually hear any sound with Bluetooth on, and I couldn't record any sound either. Uh, but with the wired headphones, it sounds really realistic. All the clicks and the bumps in the, in the track there. The, the music changed dramatically, and it got all peaceful, and these little flying things came out and everything brightened up and got greener and that's the end of the ride so let's check out the fishing game so this is the little fishing game that uh that it comes with and um 
think this is like the third or the last level. And uh, I've gotten most of the way through this game already. Most of it's free. Um, you can buy different maps and stuff to fish on, but I figured I'd catch this little fish. And in the game, you know, it has sound and everything. I just couldn't record it. But in the game, um, I can't see the fishing pole like that at all. It's really hard to see the fishing pole because it's really close to you. But I figured I'd look down at the chair. Looks a lot like the kind of chair I use to go fishing in. I guess a lot of people do too. I figured I'd just show off a couple of the fictional fish that they have. And you have like little missions throughout the game to catch certain fish. Like in this one I have to catch 10 fish in order to uh, um, help one of the bait shop owners. He wants me to catch 10 fish out of here or something. got some very quiet calm calming music and uh like i said the this video doesn't give the justice that the vr does have so if you have a galaxy s6 or better um, i definitely highly recommend the gear vr just as something a form of entertainment something kind of different and cool help support that technology and push it forward. Pickled herring, that's funny because it looks like a pickle. Oh, this is a catfish one. Leopard catfish, yeah. Looks like leopard, pretty cool. Well, I appreciate everybody checking out my uh, video on the Gear VR, and uh, um, definitely, like I said, I recommend it. Um, it's a way to, you know, kind of get out and go fishing without having to go out. So maybe in the winter time, this might be more fun. Uh, but thanks again, and uh, if you have any questions or anything, um, shoot them at me. I'll do the best I can. Also. Um, I'm going to put up a few screenshots as well of different pictures that I took.